<clears throat> Hello everyone. Welcome to After Minds. My name is Shad. I'm Vinny. Today. Welcome. Morning. Well, welcome. Yeah. Welcome. Welcome. Good morning. Is it morning? It's four o'clock in the afternoon. Some people are still waking up. Okay. Me. Lazy people. Well, I work at. <laughs> Fuck you. Okay, that's different. <laughs> that's different. Um, I get up at like five in the morning. <laughs> four. So today we're gonna be talking about some Harry Potter. Harry Potter. Um. You know, Hogwarts Legacy just came out. Everybody's kind of losing their minds about it. It's a great fucking game. Is it? It's fantastic, actually. I have not played it yet. Surprisingly great. You know, even if it hates trans people. Does it really? <laughs> have you not been hearing that? No. Because J.K. Rowling hates trans. Uh huh. Like everybody's been trying to like cancel the game and like oh, forcing people. For real? Yeah, they've been like going on Twitch streamers uh, streams and like just saying like the worst shit to them ever. Damn. Because they're playing Hogwarts Legacy. They're like, you support transphobia. It's like, I'm just trying to play this game right now. Bro. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. This yeah. game is fire. <laughs> because J.K. Rowling hates trans people, it's against the law to play the video game. So. Oh, damn. That's dumb. It's so stupid. It's like the dumbest shit ever. They're not very little high horse. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to be talking about the movies today, though. We're not going to talk about the game. Um, you know it's great. We're, so me and Vinny have ranked the eight movies. Uh, from best to worst, it was a struggle. Honestly, it was, it was a super struggle. It was hard. Oh. I couldn't. I could not place them. <laughs> Every time I placed one, I had to switch it. I was like, God damn it! <laughs> yeah, it was. Like, um, it's, it's, it's like one of those things where you just like, man, they're all good movies, yeah. but somebody's got to be last. Um, so we're gonna, we're gonna go. We're gonna start from eight, and we're gonna work our way to number one. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. I'll let you go first. You want me to go first? Yeah. My number eight is Sorcerer's Stone. That was your number eight? That's my number eight. That's your number eight. The very first movie is my number eight. Only because, I don't know, it's kid friendly, I guess. Yeah. I guess that's why I don't like it that much. I mean, it's good, but it's like, it's just like very you, kiddie to me. You don't like them like learning to fly and shit? All that stuff is great. That was like cool. But there was no like, there was no stakes. There was nothing, there was nothing really happening in that entire movie. Oh. Like nothing really went down. Yeah. My was... sorry. Go ahead. Go ahead. No, go ahead. My number eight was uh, the Deathly Hallows part, part one. Really? Yeah. It was. It was kind of slow. Uh huh. It was just a lot of like storytelling. Yes. Which I'm like, all right. Like compared to all the other movies, it was a little more like adventurous. It was like. It was a. It was it was a slow movie. It was slow. Sure. I was I'll like, admit that. I'll give you that. It was kind of like yeah. um. It was just them trying to find shit, like them yeah. just on their own. Like, well, they had the Horcrux, one of the Horcrux. Yeah, and they just couldn't figure out how to destroy it. Yeah, and I was like, and at the end is when they finally destroyed it, and I was like, mm -hmm. it took them the whole time. It took them the whole movie to destroy one. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was like, damn, that was a trouble. But it was just a lot of like running around. Um, I mean, it did have some deep meanings to it, mm -hmm. but it was mostly. It was pretty. Around. It was, it was very drama like heavy. But yeah. Like, I wouldn't say it was very action heavy. Yeah. It was very drama heavy. Compared to like all the other ones where they had some shit going on. Yeah. That's true. So that one was kind of like a, it was a slow burn for me. Yeah. I was like, all right, still, it was leading up to something bigger, but it was still pretty good. Yeah. Okay. I just put it at number eight. Deathly Hollows in number eight. Part That's one. Fair. Part one, number eight. All right. I can see that. My number seven is Chamber of Secrets. <laughs> <laughs> My number seven was, uh, Sorcerer's Stone. Was it really? <laughs> I was like, yeah, it had a little more action in there. Sorcerer's Stone? Then Deathly yeah. Hollows? The part one, yeah. Nah, so like, they learned no. to fly. Okay. That was pretty cool. They, they introduced cool. the the games. Oh, fuck, what was it? The games. thought I wrote it down, but I didn't. Quidditch? The Quidditch games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are cool. And uh, like some of the magic that they learned to do yeah. was pretty dope. Okay. My God, you love you. God, you love you. I think I do. I do think the introduction of Hogwarts is better. Yeah, for sure. Like getting into that magical world and just being like, man, all this cool shit. I can, I can understand that. I can understand that. But over Deathly Hollows? Yeah, that's interesting. That's interesting to me. Um, I put, I put Chamber of Secrets there just because. Again, it was just the beginning, and it was just like, it ain't hitting me like it should hit me. Yeah. 
Although I do love Chamber of Secrets though. Um, I think it's fantastic. I, uh, the big snake at the end, the climax is great. The whole Tom Riddle thing with the diary was cool. Yeah. Um, but I just, again, it's just like, the stakes were there, but they weren't there for me. Like, ain't nothing, nothing was going on still. It was still pretty childish. But the stuff with the uh, spiders, though, in the Forbidden Forest were pretty dope. Yeah. I fucked with that because the prosthetics on that was pretty dope. Yeah, that shit was scary. It was, it was scary. <laughs> Nightmares. <laughs> okay. What was your number six? My number six was uh, Chamber of Secrets. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, you're like, one up me. I'm like, oh, yeah. fuck. fuck. <laughs> I can't believe you put Deathly Hollows last, though. It just, it wasn't my favorite. All right, that's fair. Because my number six is Deathly Hollows Part 1. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, my number six is uh, Chamber of Secrets. Damn, so pretty much all of our... The last four are all the same for us. Yeah. Just in different spots. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Damn, that's Don't interesting. Look at my list. Huh? Don't look at my list. Don't look at my list. Alright. Yeah, Deathly Hollows, I would yeah. admit... The only reason I put it at six is because uh, Dobby's death. That's the only. That was reason. tough. That hurt. It hurt. It hurt bad. That's why I put it in there. I was like, "Damn, that's that was rough." Yeah. And that's. It was. A he was a free elf. He was a free elf. When he me. got stabbed and then he's on the beach, he's like, "Harry Potter." I was like, "Ah!" I... Harry Potter. Toby cried. <laughs> Did you? I don't care. I, I fucking cried. I cried too. <laughs> it's it's it sucks. There's been a lot of deaths in Harry Potter. Yeah, that was like one of the hardest ones. That was definitely one of the more harder ones for sure. I'll get I'll get to that later when we get to that list because there's some deaths in here that I'm real disappointed in. There's more. Oh, there's more. Yeah, there's more deaths. Yes, of course. No, I mean like that were worse than that. Oh, that's worse than Dobby's. <laughs> nah, his is the worst. I think yeah, his, his is, the worst. is the worst. He's so childlike. That's why He's I think so it's so innocent. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think that was the he worst one for sure. Wants to help. Dobby's him. death is tough. Yeah. It'll break you. Um, it broke me. It broke me. But my number five is the fifth movie, Order of Phoenix. I got the Prisoner of Azkaban. That's number five? Yeah. What the fuck is wrong with you? Just... Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Order of Phoenix to me was okay. I don't know. It was like, I probably should have put it a little bit lower. <laughs> <laughs> I should have put it a little lower. I should have put it at six. I don't know. The werewolves were pretty dope. Um, For Prisoner of like, Man? Yeah. Okay. Like the transformations that they would do. The transformation is phenomenal. Yeah. You could tell they had like more money. Yeah. So the effects were pretty dope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so it was, it was pretty good. For like the third movie. For the third how movie. much money that they actually had it's was phenomenal. actually. I was like, oh. They put a little more. Yeah. A little, finesse into it. A little bit of this in it? Yeah. <laughs> I was like, all right. Like. These effects are good. Yeah. The way that they um, uh, they portrayed the werewolves were... I thought they were bad. They were, they were pretty badass. Yeah. They were fantastic, actually. But, uh, is, what was it? Um, Sirius Black? Sirius Black's transformation. That shit was... Sirius shit Black. That dick. All of that shit is so good to yeah. me, bro. I loved it. The time traveling. Yeah. All that. Oh, the time traveling was amazing. Oh. So great. Makes me want to live in that world. <laughs> it does, right? The reason, main reason I have it at number five is Sirius' death. His death in that movie. That was. It was too. Yeah. It was too quick to the yeah. point where you didn't even know what happened, and that kind of pissed me off a lot, honestly, because I feel like this person means so much to Harry. Could you yeah. not have them like a, a little bit more better death than that? Yeah, he got hit. He got blindsided. He literally got blindsided, got hit, gone, yeah. and then. We as an audience didn't even have time to like register what the fuck just happened. I was just like, oh, I was like, oh, 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 oh he got hit. Oh, he's okay, right? No, he's not okay. He's fucking dead. <laughs> that's that's the only yeah. reason I put it that at five because that really pissed me off. Because like you can hear the Avada Kedavra. Yeah, yeah. And can. then the green just like go over and like. Yeah. And then I was like, oh, nah, I didn't have yeah, time yeah. to react. I was like, but is Order of Phoenix the same one where uh, Dumbledore and Voldemort fight in the Ministry of Magic? That's the same movie, right? Mm, no, that was the Order of the... F that's, yeah, that's what I'm talking about, bitch. <laughs> yeah, oh, I was looking at yeah. Because I was thinking of... Dumbledore Prisoner of Escalade, yeah. versus Voldemort. 
Yeah, when they were fighting in the Ministry of Magic. Yeah, that scene is. That was pretty dope. That's a phenomenal fight, honestly. It's great. How you just like, Gah! with all the glass. <laughs> with all the glass, Gah! turns into sand. and then, Yeah. Bro, it's fire, bro. It made his own little uh, little ball of uh, water. <laughs> water. <laughs> It's Easy. pretty lit. That 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 fight scene is fantastic to me. That reminds me of like I don't know why it always thinks I always think of like Phantom Menace when I see that fight. I don't know okay. why. Just Darth Maul versus Obi Wan and Kai Gon. You it's, know what he should have said when he was doing that? What? Chill. <laughs> Put him in some water. <laughs> no. <laughs> that would have been. Don't do too cool for that. <laughs> There's, There's no, no way. <laughs> The punchline? <laughs> you need a cool off, guy. Need a cool <laughs> <laughs> I swear, bro, if Dumbledore has some punchlines, bro, yeah, no. He escaped with his phoenix. Yeah. He was just, he was just like, yeah. Oh, yeah, that was lit. Say nothing. He's just yeah. like, you think I'm going to go quietly? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine if he had a little punchline at the end. No, bro, he doesn't need a punchline. Got a blast! <laughs> <laughs> Damn! <laughs> <laughs> Bro, that's I would really not cool. take that man serious at all. Like, what <laughs> if he says some shit like that? <laughs> no. Hate to run, but gotta fly. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't want Dumbledore making fucking quips and shit. <laughs> I think he was cool the way he was, bro. Oh. My number four was Order of the Phoenix. Was it? Yeah, because I thought it was a little better than Prisoner of Eskimo. Yeah. Okay. So. I don't know how, but okay. <laughs> Wait, um, we're doing eight like the worst, right? Yeah, eight oh, is wait. the worst. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Goblet of Fire was. Your Goblet of Fire. Yeah. Where's your Goblet of Fire? Mine Goblet of Fire is. Don't worry. Oh, about no. it. The Order of the Phoenix is four. Okay, okay. For me, it's getting better. For me, number four was Goblet of Fire. <laughs> oh, that's number one. Yeah. All right. Yeah. No, four. your four is Order of Phoenix. Yeah, mine. Oh. Okay, okay. I see. I see. I see, I see. Uh, Order of the Phoenix. Yeah. yeah four, my Sorry. four is Order of the Phoenix. That's uh, Goblet of Fire. God Sorry. damn it! I'm getting confused. I'm, I'm, I'm confused. <laughs> We're talking about your movie. Yours was your four Order of the was Order of Phoenix. My four is God of, Goblet of Fire. Yeah. Okay. 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 All right. <laughs> All right. So yeah, number four for me is Goblet of Fire. Um, mine was Order of the Phoenix. I hate uh, Homebridge. One of her. Is that Order of the Phoenix? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Fuck oh, her. They introduced her, and I was like, this bitch. I Bro, put it in here. Umbridge is the worst. I put worst. Lady in Pink. Kill her. Kill her. <laughs> that was like the most annoying thing ever was that fucking Dude, lady. she and was like, the worst thing. Like, she even either, either needs she to was get like, fucked. Honestly, she was or... next to Voldemort to me. Like, there's Voldemort. Hate him. She's like right under him. Nah, she's right on top. I fucking hate her. You hate her more than Voldemort? Yeah. <laughs> Because at least Voldemort did some cool shit. True. That is true. He was doing some cool shit. He she was, was doing, just being a was, bitch. Yeah. And I was like, why the fuck is she still... Why, why hasn't anybody, like, tried to kill her? Bro, no one tried to kill her? You know what's crazy to me? Is at the end of Order of Phoenix, the centaurs drag her off, right? Yeah. And then the next couple of movies, they fucking... They show, she shows back up. Nobody could have killed her? No like, one could have killed nobody? her? Anybody? Fred and George quit school, got expelled. Yeah. And none of them can take him out. Yeah. Gonna hit him. <laughs> like, yo, somebody put a hit on this so bitch. Yes. Like, <laughs> knowing, like, how much she was affecting bro, she the was, Ministry of Magic. She was and how literally much she was, torturing kids, bro. She was, like, in there fucking everybody. Bro, she was fucking the whole school and everybody. And she tried to get that one teacher fired. What? Yeah. Oh, fuck. The one that fuck tells the future. Yeah, the bro. And the tea. Fuck that lady, dude. Nah, bitch. she was being a bitch. She yeah. was. I, I, I'll, I'll give you that. She's worse than Voldemort. Yeah, that's <laughs> why... <laughs> She's way worse she's than way worse. Oh I don't. I don't like that bitch, bitch at all. Nah, she was trash. You're right. You're right. You're right. Um, bitch. but yeah, my four was Goblet of Fire. Um, I know people put Goblet of Fire like their number one, but for me, it's just the tournament phase. And the reason I put Goblet of Fire at four because Ron was pissing me off. Ron's a little bitch. Bro, Ron was lying. pissing me off that whole fucking movie, yeah. and I really hated him. And I hated what they did with that. It How was, he was being pet, you know, because he was. Goblet of Fire is my number three, so I'll talk about this right oh, now. Oh, is it number three? Okay, number okay, three. okay. So they were how Ron was all wet over um, Victor, Victor, Victor Crumb. Crumb at first, yeah. yeah, when they went to the World Cup. Yeah, yeah. And then like after Hermione's over there, like I'm going to the ball with him. I'd be like, yo, bring him to hang out with this. Yeah, bro. Adventures, like give me an autograph, something, bro. What? Like he was all like he was all up his ass, yeah. and then once she started dating him, he started being a little bitch. Yeah. 
That pissed me off, bro. And then that, he, and then him being upset by Harry being in the yeah competition. I was like, like I would have been like, well, I would have been on my friend's side, bro. That's what I'm like, saying. After right? being through all that shit, I thought he like, was gonna be in like, my mind. I'm like, oh, he's just in the tournament. Whatever. I got his back though. Yeah. Like this like, man was like, oh, he said it new. I fucking believe him. That's what After I'm saying. All the battle and shit that we've done. Like, After everything we lie. fucking did, bro, you think he's just gonna lie about that shit? Yeah, he's not gonna lie to Come me. Come on now, bro. That was so fucking stupid. He's being all petty. That's why I put it in number four. I know people like rank Goblet of Fire so fucking high, but like but me, the, if it, it that <laughs> almost ruins the movie for me. The Tri Wizard like tournament though, like the tournament itself. Like, the tournament how itself is dope. Fire. That was it was great. That was very cool. Fantastic. The dragons, the fucking dark magic, the dark magic, the that underwater was stuff. Dope. Yeah, was really cool. Uh, <laughs> the maze was dope, but I think when they go to see Voldemort is pretty phenomenal. Yeah, that's what that's why I put it at four because I was gonna put it lower to be honest with you. Really? I was gonna put it's it like stupid. six or seven. <laughs> But the reason, but I put it at four because I was like, when Voldemort showed up, and then he killed Cedric. Yeah, that was some real shit. Yeah. I love that. I love that scene. That scene is fantastic. That show was pretty hard. It was pretty no, no, wait. They they killed him after after mm -hmm. Voldemort came. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. They no. killed because Frederick before the Wormtail is holding Voldemort yeah. as little baby, and then Wormtail kills him. Yeah, because Voldemort was like, kill the spare. Yeah, <laughs> <He's>, <laughs> yeah. Kill the other one. Kill the other one. Yeah, I um, that shit I love that. I love that whole scene. And Cedric's death was pretty sad. Like when they brought his body back and, and his, his dad, dad was yeah. Oh, that my shit boy. had me in tears. Hey, my son. <laughs> That's my son. This is my boy. This is my boy. Him and like, <laughs> so it was uh, Dobby's death. Yeah. Sirius Black. Frederick. Uh, Cedric Diggory? Cedric. You put Cedric over Sirius? I no, mean, no, Sirius no. over Cedric? No, no. Yeah, I put Sirius. So it was Dobby. Dobby's the saddest? The saddest death. And then it was uh, Sirius Black. Sirius? This was pretty sad. Okay. And was, then Cedric? He deserves better than that quick shit. Yeah, he did deserve better than quick shit. Okay, okay. I, I think I'll put Cedric over. Serious blacks only because there was so much more emotion behind it. Yeah, because the dad was over there. The, that That's dad, my the, boy. Da, the dad scene ruined my me. Bro. Boy. I'm like, <laughs> ah, oh, daddy, <laughs> daddy. I miss my own dad. Honestly, yeah, that just that alone killed me for that scene. Yeah, that's why I put it over serious. Serious is like it was just too quick. I didn't like how quick it was. It they me did off. him dirty. They did him dirty. He deserves better. Uh, that was your number three, right? That was my number. My three. number three was Deathly Hollows Part Two. My, it's my number Don't two. talk about your two, right? Yet. Why can't I talk about Because I haven't talked about my three yet. Fuck you already you. talked about your three. Okay, what's your three? Deathly Hollows Part 2. Okay, well, I'm not going to talk about it because mine's a little higher. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Deathly Hollows Part 2 is phenomenal. Um, it's I think it's a great way to end the, the whole thing. I think they did a great job. I feel like it could have went like downhill completely. They could have fucked it up completely, but I feel like they did a great job at the ending. Um... All the fights were dope. The all these side characters had their moments. People died. <laughs> Hell of people died. Hell of people died. Is this this one where Mad Eye Mooney died? No, it's the first one, Deathly Hollows. Yeah. That was too quick for me too. That was That one, that whole that whole sequence of them getting killed was too much, too quick for me. I didn't I didn't like that for Deathly Hollows part one. But Deathly Hollows Part yeah, Two. Yeah, because they were they were dressed up as Harry Potter and flying. Yeah, yeah, flying around. Yeah, and shit. yeah, yeah. That was it. Was just. And then the twin butter. butter Could have been done shot. better for characters that we've been spending this much. There was a lot of. Uh, There's a lot of deaths. Lupin died, right? Yeah. And his wife. No, no, no. Lupin died, and then the other two people died. I don't remember their name. The uh, the one girl and the guy, the redhead guy. Um. Uh. It was his wife. His they wife were married, died. right? Because they yeah. got married, and then that's when Death Eaters attacked their shit. Yeah. What and then, the fuck was her name, bro? Uh, Severus Snape. The goat. The goat. The goat. Probably the greatest character ever created. His turnaround, like how he was actually in love with his mom. It's so beautiful. I was like... Aww. When you Harry tell Potter, me like his dad was a dick. <laughs> when you tell me you watch Harry Potter and then you get to that point and you be like called it, no one called that. Nobody called that. No one I knew that no that shit idea. was gonna happen. <laughs> yeah. 
And when I tell you, it makes him like the best character ever, bro, in Harry Potter, easily. Like he made it seem like he hated Harry with a passion. Hated him with a passion. But like deep down, he cared the most about him. He loved him so much. That's wild, bro. He had her eyes. Ugh, you talking about Weep City? Yeah. I was crying, crying. And when he got killed and ate by the snake? Yeah. Fuck you, Voldemort. Yeah, you punk bitch and you're fucking... Dumbass snake, bro. Dumbass snake. I hate that. Piece of shit fucking rat so with sad. no legs. It was, it was pretty sad, <laughs> honestly. Rat with no legs. <laughs> Probably top tier, top tier character, top tier ending, for sure. That was pretty crazy. Was and you know good. what I love mm. about this whole thing? Mm. How they can share the memories just like... Hey. Oh, yeah. And just oh. Like, oh, that's amazing. You know what? There would be so much... <laughs> So many memories that I'm like, I'm gonna save this one, save this one, save this one. Well, if someone I gets into this one. If someone gets into your cabinet, they gonna see that shit. Yeah. <laughs> that's why you pull oh, it out. Oh god. That's why you. Nah, that's. That's great. why I would pull it out to share it. Yeah. But instead, it's like social media. You take the photo. You true. Share it, true. Share that moment. But uh. But nah, you can't see it like they see it. In I their do. Eyes. I do love that. Like. Dumbledore would just be in a corner somewhere and just be like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this one, this like one. there was like so many movies where he was just, <laughs> yeah. Told me this shit. Uh, all right. Whatever. Top two. Top uh, two. What was your top two? What, what was, was my top two? Okay. My number two. Half Blood Prince. Mine was that. Was what, Yours is Half Blood Prince too. Yeah. Really? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Half Blood Prince. Yeah. Number two was Half Blood Prince. Both yeah. of us. That movie is very cool. underrated to me. What? I think people. I mean, I think people don't oh, yeah. give it enough credit. Yeah, like the whole crux that they were kid, like finally like put it in some work with Dumbledore. Dumbledore, like Dumbledore finding the Horcrux and like going to town on everybody and then yeah. like. But just like seeing how he can actually like destroy him. Yeah, easy. easily, bro. And then in Deathly Hallows Part uh, One, mm-hmm. they were struggling. They were struggling. Hard. <laughs> I was like, yo, what the fuck, is D- <laughs> like Dumbledore? Yeah, we bro. need him back. Yeah, and everything everything with Malfoy in Half Blood Prince is so good too. Yeah, I love it so much. That's what I want to talk about. So Harry, po- Harry Potter tried to kill uh, Malfoy. Bro, he straight up tried to murder yeah, that man. Yeah, and then nobody was like, no one said a thing. I was right put on there. It's like he wanted blood. <laughs> everyone, everyone just let it go. <laughs> bro, bro, this is that should have been like the first thing we should have known with Snape's character because he went into yeah. the bathroom and, and saved, saved him. him. Yeah, I was, I was like, like yo. What? No one's gonna snitch on this man? Like Harry Potter just straight up shotgunned <laughs> this guy to the chest. Uh, all the rumors <laughs> they start for Harry, bro. Murderer is not one of them. Yeah. I would have been like, yo, this nigga Harry just <laughs> murdered Malfoy, bro. What I would have, like, if I was Malfoy, and after like everything that happened, I'd have been like keeping an eye on this guy. Bro. Yeah, dude, Malfoy what the try fuck? To kill me. He literally, he, Malfoy would be dead right now for yeah. whatever state. He would be yeah. dead right now. He'd be uh, Moni Myrtle. <laughs> Another Just one in the boys' bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> He'd be there forever. He would be. Yeah. He would be there forever, bro. Like, how'd you die? Fucking Harry Potter. I feel like that <laughs> scene gets glossed over a lot. It really does. No one like, talks about it. I thought about it and I was like, yo, Harry. Yo, Harry really tried to kill that man. <laughs> Harry's out for blood. <laughs> hey, honestly, if I've been through this, it's like, what, my fifth year here yeah. at Hogwarts and now every time I come, it's like shit. Because it was, they, that scene was after, um, Dumbledore died. No, it wasn't. Yeah, it was because they were chasing each other. No, it wasn't. Because Harry was. That was way before, was it? No, Harry was down. He's like, get down below. No, that was not. That was not after that. Yeah, it was. No, it was not. Yeah, guarantee you. Because that's when the whole fight started. Because everyone went down. Because they didn't start the attack till after Dumbledore died, and then that's when Harry was like. Yeah. But he didn't. He didn't attack. He didn't attack Malfoy after that. It was after. I guarantee you, it was not. Pretty sure it was after. It was like in the middle of the fucking movie. Because then after that, uh, when they all ran, they ran down to Hagrid's house and blew his head up. And then that's when Snape told Harry, like, I'm the Half-Blood Prince, you've been using my spell. You think it's gonna work on me? Ah, uh, fuck, you're right. <laughs> like, damn, he tried to kill him before. He tried to kill him way earlier in the movie. He's like, you think you're the Half-Blood Prince? Just open the credits and he's like, me! <laughs> <laughs> I'm, the half- I'm the chosen one. I'm the chosen one. Yeah, bro, I honestly, I love Half Blood Prince. It's so good. The death of Dumbledore is crazy, and just Malfoy's just like Hard development me. is insane to me. Bro. Yeah, like how deep and dark he was getting. It, it, he was getting dark, but you could tell he was still a child. It yeah. kind of made me tear up a little bit when he was just like, "I have to kill. I have to do this." 
It's gonna kill like, me. Yeah. That that to me like that's good character writing too. Cause, yeah. Like, you can tell he's just a terrified child. You know what sucks? Mm. It's like I'm pretty sure this guy like still gets shit for it. For being Malfoy? Yeah. Honestly, I think he does, but honestly, I think he's fine with it. Because he, he, he said did, in he an did. interview recently, he's like, I would definitely come back and play Malfoy if they wanted me to. And I was like, I would. Damn, he's, that was good. Yeah. He's, he's that really was great. Um, what was I going to Well, well what was your number one then? Deathly Hallows Death Part, Part, Part 2. Mine's just Prisoner of Azkaban. Deathly Hallows Part 2. Yeah. I love Prisoner of Azkaban so much. Yeah. I I would, I would die for that movie. movie. That movie's so good. The only reason I love it so much is because like it's like the one time we don't deal with Voldemort. It was just like a personal thing between Harry and his family, and it was just more interesting to me learning yeah. about Harry's family. Yeah. That's Most, why it's, that's why it's my number one. And the cinematography in it was absolutely amazing. Yeah. The transformation scene with Lupin transforming, bro, is just beautiful. There's nothing better. There's nothing better than that. It's, it's fucking phenomenal to me. I watch that scene all the time. It didn't feel like a Harry Potter movie. I think that's why I liked it. It was just for me. It's the fucking the shot of the moon, and then the yeah. zoom in into his eye, and then like the it zoom was... out, and it's like, ugh, it's so goddamn good, bro. You know that was that was pretty dope. It is. I love Prisoner Ashman. And people tell me that I'm stupid for putting it number number one. But eat my asshole. Yeah, I would have definitely put it a little lower. You, I know, bitch. You put it at what? Six? Seven? Don't worry about it. Mind your business. <laughs> Golly. I put it at five. Five? Five. Disrespectful. Oh, yeah, right there. Oh, yeah, shit. right there, right there. Oh. Like, all of that just... Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> 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 it's such a it's such a good dope scene, bro. Everything about it, bro. You know what sucks is like he had no control None. over it. None at all. And when they were explaining like the difference between werewolves and the what was it what are they called? The Animagus. Animagus. Yeah. Like the difference is the werewolf can turn on its own willingly. But the, the other one has no control. It can the animagus can transform on its own, and yeah. then they'll attack whoever, not yeah. like knowing, not they're knowing like that they're killing animal. their fans. Yeah, yeah. I do love that too. I just didn't like how like ugly it looks. It looks it looks like shit. I don't like yeah. how it looks either. It's a shit design for a werewolf, but it was everything like leading up to it is fantastic. <laughs> it's literally like, like a literally a half man, half wolf. Like a man fucked a werewolf had to be even better. But yeah, I love Prisoner of Azkaban. It's great. It's fantastic. Oh, yeah, and one was got the hollow. great, huh? The battle was. D yeah. After like, you could see like after all these years how strong they all got. Yeah. yeah like Hermione see. when she's running, and fucking just go 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 go. I'd have been dealing, honestly, I would have tried to have like two wands. I'd have been like, ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Dual wielding wands? Yeah. We ain't never seen that before. Exactly. That's if not you, a thing, though. But if you can. Remember, the wand chooses the person. Yeah, but when you disarm one, that wand becomes yours. Oh, yeah, that's right. Two wands. <laughs> 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 I mean, I guess you that could. That would have been fucking fire. It would have been overkill. Imagine having the two most powerful wands. That means your spell has got to be on point, though. Yeah. But sometimes you don't have to spell. You just... Yeah, some people just kind of just toss it, but... I'd just be like sideways. Like a fucking... <laughs> a drummer. Bah! Get the whole fucking roll like a machine gun. Oh. Dual wielding wands. That's great. Never thought about it. No one Definitely thought about it. Too. I, what I hate is... Harry breaking the Elder Wand. <laughs> Yeah. What's wrong with you? You motherfucker. What's wrong? What that are you doing? That shit was straight from death. And you, it's yours. <laughs> <laughs> like, it was just nothing, bro. Yeah. Why would you do that? Ugh. I think it's just. Fucking idiot. Don't want to give anybody else the power. I understand, but it's fucking retard. Yeah, that's you, so fucking. You got, you have all three. But somebody would kill him for that. Yeah. They like, would. if they, sure. if he kept it. Someone would have been cloak. like, I want. He had the resurrection one. stone and he had the. the he, he was death. death. <laughs> <laughs> that thing was death. death. That's why he took out Malfoy. <laughs> so he took out Malfoy the way Dude, he did. That imagine was death. if he fucking just had that stone in his pocket. Bro, like. <laughs> 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 he 
Just the cloak and then the Elder Wand? Just yeah. <laughs> Kept the stone in his pocket so if he got shot. Ugh. Honestly, bro. Ugh. I don't know why he did that, but I guess so Dude, people wouldn't Harry could have fucking took out all of them. He could have been a new headmaster, to be honest with you. <laughs> like, that man was powerful. He was death. He was death. And he, he just said, just... fuck it. He just said. Yeah. Like. <laughs> Imagine if he, like, just threw the cloak in the fire, threw the rock. Somewhere. I'm pretty sure he probably got rid of that rock too. That thing's pretty OP. He no, died. they were they were breaking the rock. Remember when they were in the Sorcerer Stone? He was like hitting it. Hitting Not it. that one. The other one, Resurrection Stone. Oh, the Resurrection. There's a scene in the Forbidden Forest where he has the Resurrection Stone. It's yeah. tiny, really Die. small. He's talking with Draco's mom, and like he dies, but because he had that Resurrection Stone on him, he came back to life. Oh, does yeah. it just work once? I don't know. I don't know if it works more than once. But most people would. most people don't catch that in the movie, but Harry died. And Harry was a horcrux, and that's why. Yeah. I remember that. Yeah. So he got killed, but the, he had the Resurrection Stone, brought him back perfectly fine. That's why he was able to kill him. What a great series overall, though. Damn. Our lists were pretty close, though. I don't know why. Honestly, they were fair, fairly close. If I would have just put this one on top, it would have been all lined up. If probably, <laughs> this yeah, one honestly... Here, you're right. It probably would have been lined yeah. up pretty well. Fairly close. Yeah. <clears throat> Don't judge me for putting Prisoner Azkaban up top. Nah, fucking judge him. Eat my asshole. Judge him. I love Prisoner Azkaban. Fuck Seth, Seth Diggory. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I mean, damn. <laughs> I'm just kidding. He was kidding. like, oh, he's a bad man. My boy. Vengeance. <laughs> my son. It's my boy. God, that shit's still heartbreaking. Uh. I cry every time I see that one. I do too. I tear up. I can't oh even my, would my dad cry? Of course he would. Yeah. <laughs> I don't have a dad. Uh, I'll be your dad. No, you're not gonna. Cry I'll cry for you. Don't you cry worry about a baby. <laughs> Come here, my son. Let this us my let boy. us know. Let us know what's your favorite That's Harry Potter my movie. Son. <laughs> let us know what your favorite uh, Harry Potter movie is, please. Yeah. Let Which us know. Which one was the best? Uh, let us know what you think of our list. Pretty spot on. Well, same, same. Same, same, but different. Somebody's in the door. Okay. All right, All right guys. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs>